Yeah, we have Harrison Ezeko, uh, who is a member of the campaign uh, council, uh, so 2024 uh, Edo State uh, election, and uh, also to uh, a political analyst. Uh, to Harrison, you welcome to this program. Good morning. Good then, morning, viewers. Yeah, we have uh, Nowita Egbotako, the uh, very astute uh, uh, conflict resolution expert and author, Syria author of uh, many books. Nowita Egbotako, you welcome to the program. Good morning. It's a pleasure to be here. All right. So, gentlemen, uh, we're going to be looking at two key issues. Uh, first and foremost, we'll start in Edo State from Edo State issues. Uh, looking at uh, exactly one month. Uh, today is 21st of August 2024. So in another one month, <laughs> Edolites are going to be going to the pools uh, to uh, cast their vote for their <coughs> preferred uh, candidates uh, in the election. Now, we've got so, so many counts down, you may want to say, as we prepare for this election, things that we cannot turn our eyes against from. Particularly recent developments, how uh, allegations of uh, some uh, party men in the PDP being uh, threatened, being arrested, and all that. And of course, uh, we also saw uh, in our news yesterday where well, uh, the Council of Councillors in, in Nigeria had to come together uh, to say that no, uh, this time, you know, trying to let Nigeria police first know that this should not be. So, how do we begin to react to all of all this? Looking at Edo 2024 uh, in mind, Harrison Ezeko. Well, thank you very much. Uh, <clears throat> good morning, Edo people. <clears throat> I, I think that, uh, you know, in every election here, uh, there are apprehensions like this, and uh, especially when the opposition uh, perceive that they are not on ground. So the best thing they feel they can do is to see how they can distort the, the exercise or threaten people, bring a threat ahead so that people can be afraid, so that on that day people will not come out to vote. But Edo people are wise people. We know the truth. We know what we are feeling. There is no market for PDP. There is no market for APC. There is no market for Labour Party. When you get to the market, the price of food stuff is general for everybody. So what is going on in this country today, we are all feeling it. Today, as I speak with you now, a liter of food is 950 naira. People cannot eat. Price of goods and is so expensive. A bag rice is 100,000. And uh, people will see sit down. I want to see promote uh, illegality. And want to think that you not be you, you get into power through the back door. It cannot work in the do state. Yes, uh, many persons have been threatened. One of our counselors who speak was arrested. Uh, we are not deterred. Yes, we by the grace of God. I'm the vice chairman at Do South um, uh, Nigeria um, uh, Do State the Counselors Forum. We had a press conference on the issue. We have made the public know the party is doing their part, and they should inform the IG. It should stop this uh, style they are going about doing this. Even if you want to, there are issues. A legislator, a legislator, you invite the person. Whether you are a legislator or the national, you are a senator or the state or local government. Legislator is a legislator. You went to a house and picked him at the middle of the night. As you speak, his whereabouts is unknown. So I think that our people should understand that politics is not a do or die affair. We should sit down this time around and allow this issue of uh, a partisan living life as if there is no tomorrow. People will sit down and look at the various candidates that they have put forth for this election. No amount of intimidation We make any political party bringing somebody through the back door. What Edo people we, we, we use as a benchmark is, is the, the capacity and the competence of the candidate. They want to look at the person on the bylaws. What does this person have to offer? Where is this person coming from? What has this person done in the past? Because to be sincere with you, people are tired of these politicians because nothing has actually come out of it. That is the basic truth. It is not all about the political party. It's about the person. I'm saying this because the last election, some persons got into the Senate and that's what they took the obedient movement. Even when we know that they cannot even contest our own counselorship. But they were there. But today is the same thing. They were part of those who collect 150 million dollars to, to buy one car. None of them rejected. So it's not about the party. It's about the individual. I can say for free, when this man, the, 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 the MD of the Siva, there was his name again. I remember there was a time, my, my yeah. he rejected. A single, he said, no, we cannot accept this kind of money. That is a man with integrity. It's not the party, it's the individual. So I don't people this time around, they sit down and look at the individual. We have suffered too much in this, in this country. We don't want somebody that will come and drag us back. 
You don't want somebody who doesn't have anything upstairs, who have no plan, who have nothing to offer. As we speak today, is only one party, only one candidate that have been able to present a, a manifesto to adopt people that this is the direction of the government. Others just wake up today, they will say this. Tomorrow they will say this. He will tell you what to do this. In the next few minutes, you ask him again, saying another thing. Okay. There is no direction. Okay. We are appealing to adopt people. Don't be intimidated. Relax yourself. Whatever they are doing, that they cannot do anything. The truth will prevail. People will go on that day and cast their vote. And you will vote, and your vote will be defend. Def you defend your vote. Nobody should be afraid. But we are using media to tell the Nigerian police that they are not supposed to be partisans. They should do the right thing. We are tired of this kind of life we are living. Anyway, Whether you are a politician or not, all of us go to the same market. Yeah. Even the policemen go to the same market. Yeah, let, Today, we cannot eat in this state, yeah. in this country. And right. people will still sit down and do what is wrong. Yeah, we, we, we are really here yet to hear a statement from the Nigeria Police Force uh, consigning uh, the allegations on how uh, some PDP members have been arrested. But uh, for the civil society perspective, no, we'll you, we'll you, that's where you belong. How does uh, how is uh, the civil society in industry reacting to uh, some of these allegations uh, that um, uh, polit politicians are being threatened? Uh, you know, to light to uh, the election. Well, uh, my hypnosis to the political reality, you know, prevailing in those is very clear, and I'm, I'm going to take it from the perspective of the civil society. You know, that I said, yeah, you know. Never at any time do we support illegality. Never at any time do the people that we represent in civil society you know, support toggery, uh, arson, intimidation. Because these are, first, they are, these are you know, uh, factors that drag us back. For goodness sake, where are we? Other, other, other nations in other climes, they are moving forward. Look at what is happening in America, for instance. Look at transparency at the highest level. Look at people coming out to, 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 to discuss their manifestos. Mm. Look, at, look, 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 look at what happened in, in, in UK the other day. Transparency at, at the highest level. What is the problem with Nigeria? What is the problem with the politicians? I, I like what you said, the problem is with the politicians. That's the what we have is, is, is government of, for, the, for the politician, by the politician, and for the politicians. It's quite unfortunate. The civil society is hungry. The civil society, the civil society is not on the same page with those who want to tell people to cannot fold us. It, 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 it is un unacceptable. Because all these things have not taken us to anywhere. We are stuck. Nigeria is not moving forward. So the civil society supports a transparency process whereby all political parties and the candidates are giving level playing feed to set themselves. Not for some cabal uh, in one corner, you know, trying to strangulate the electoral process. We will not allow that. Mm. And, and I want to tell the, the people that they do not allow themselves and their words to be used as cabal folders. They are not taking anybody anywhere. Look at where we are. In a country where we have uh, the mainstay is petroleum products. We cannot buy products easily. Is that not insanity? Look at where misgovernance. Lack of visionary data. Look at where they're taking us. So it's, it's a wonderful opportunity for, 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 for those people to remain focused and not to allow any power, no one matter from anywhere, to, 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 to truncate their desire, mm. their position, their aspirations for peace Full elections in a dual state. Okay. All right. So uh, we also understand that INEC, uh, as at yesterday, released uh, their voter uh, register, voters register now to political parties. And uh, any moment from now, we're going to be having the distribution of uh, the voters' cards to those that we registered, those that did transfer, and all that. Uh, so for the political parties, they are also not arresting in their hours. Campaigns are on. <laughs> you know, the momentum is high. And of course, uh, they show force here and there for various uh, political parties. Now, uh, one thing that uh, we are not uh, looking at, we are not looking at a situation whereby how best we can have a peaceful election. 
Uh, there is an inter-party advisory agency now, you know, that um, ensure that there's a peaceful election. But for us, uh, the Edolites, are we looking at the possibility of having a peaceful election? Because without peace, we, we cannot even have the election in the first place, uh, Harrison Ezeko. Well, by the special grace of God, the election will be peaceful. Uh, it will be peaceful in the sense that for us as a party, that I represent the PDP. We, we are not violent people. We have presented our candidate. I'm very happy that our party brought in somebody outside the political space. If not, we will be in the same mess. We, we are telling the two people to assess the persons we have brought on board and look at other parties. And actually, within your heart, look at these people and decide who is actually the best, who really have the people at heart, who really love these people, who is really prepared to do this work. Who have a direction? Like I said, we are campaigning. We are sending a message through uh, our manifesto, mm. the pathway to prosperity. Mm. Our manifesto is everywhere. We are talking to the people based on what we have on document. So at the end of the day, Edo people can hold us accountable. At the end of the day, if they actually individually vote for a candidate, they will be able to follow bit by bit. You said you would do this. You said you would do this. For others, you just come up on air and say with your mouth. Today you say this, but you say another thing. And let's be peaceful in the sense that Edo people know where they are coming from. Edo people know how the present government have progressed to this stage. We know where Oshomole left this stage. He did his best. He did well. From Oshomole, the, the government took over. Also, if, if, if somebody was asking, you can't do comparison. Because the man went to several areas. And I don't move to this stage. We don't want to go back. We need somebody that will be able to pick it from there, who have the competence, the capacity, the character, and the intelligence to move a door to another level. Yeah, well, and when, this when, is what we want to do when you by say, selling our candidates. When people. you say you don't want to go back now, does it mean that when another political party comes into power in Edo State, Edo State is going back? Uh, from, 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 the, from the the candidate they have projected to us, mm. if we allow it, we are going to, um, it's going to be 20 steps backward. <laughs> because we have our sex there. They don't have the capacity. That but is from the your truth. From your perspective. That is what I'm saying. Mm. We, we, you, you see them when they campaign. Mm. They, don't have the, they don't have the capacity. You hear somebody telling you, do you want your mineral back? I will give you back your mineral. For goodness sake, in this modern day, I mean, we, 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 we are not insane. This is, this is a state where we have a, a professor who has been a governor, although he was shot for, for, for a short time. And today you just wake up and you don't bring anybody you like to come and become a governor. Just because you want to hold sway to the to the resources of the state, you oh. want to bring a puppet. It will not work. Oh, I know. And so, and and, from, and, and the space the way it is, you know that uh, those centers of that district are not producing governor. Mm. And that is why all the candidates we are pushing their uh, all the parties we try to push their candidate from that senatorial district. Mm. Today we have the APCs. Pick their own from there, the PDP also brought their own from there. So the election is between the people. Even the those people want to support them. But we have been in government now for 16 years. Mm. They, are, they are those speaking people. Mm. It will be out of place to also bring another Edoma from the same local government. The outgoing government is going. It, for me, I don't accept it because I'm a, I'm a human rights activist. I'm not a conventional politician. You're a politician. You, no, I'm not a conventional politician. <laughs> well, I, I, you, I have a second You're address. a counselor. I, 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 a politician. I, I, no, you're a counselor in government. This is not a profession. This is where we are missing it. Yeah. It's not. It's not a profession. But I only have an opportunity to serve in public. But you're a registered politician. You're a card holder. Is there anywhere on the state? You're a card holder of the PDP. Let me learn. Is there anywhere in the world that because you are a member of a political party that you cannot participate in government in 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 government or any other thing. No, is there no, any saying that, that, but you are a politician. No, mm. politics is not a profession. Mm. Until we get this idea, we'll move forward. Mm. That is why these politicians see themselves as a demigod. Mm. Because you have given them the space that we are the politicians who are doing it. Right, let, 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 let if me. you are a legislator, yeah. for me, the day of my sitting, I go, the other day in my workshop, I'm working. Beautiful. Now, now, we type butako, now, we type butako. now, for you guys in the civil society, uh, perhaps you guys don't really belong to any political party. Uh, I mean, your own interest is for uh, the benefit of for all. Your interest cuts across all political parties and all that. But uh, I wanted to react to what he said, that Edo State cannot be taken back. Uh, you know, he's trying, I mean, he, can, he will <laughs> promote, promote his cause, his yeah, political yeah. party and all that. But let's look at it now. Does it now mean that if another uh, party comes into power in Edo State, Edo State is going back? Is that what we're looking Where, at? Uh, what 
we believe in is progressive tendencies. Mm. I'm sure he's trying to... Which is governance. Governance. Go not, go not politics. We <laughs> believe not that politics. governance should be... You know, progressive. Progressive. Yeah. Not retrogressive. Mm. I'm sure that is what we're trying to say. Mm. But I do not agree with him that it's only his political... Because he has to speak for his political party. Mm. I am not a, you know, a politician. I am a civil society activist. But we have our political sentiment anyway. Mm. But I want to say that uh, the way it should be, people should be given opportunities. As simple as the that. best should appear. <laughs> I think I, I agree with him on that. The best candidate should appear. And I don't, we, I, and I don't subscribe to, 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 to any situation, to any manipulation, such as what is playing out now, to want to gag. To want to strangulate, to want to impose, to want to manipulate the process. We don't subscribe to that. We, we, we want a level playing field. Let the best guys appear. No, let no, let the electorate no, decide. No, it are, is not to decide. Gagging and imposing is relative. <laughs> you understand? But in the general political, in the general political process, mm. it, it's been uh, smoked up. Smoked, smoked up in the sense that the, the, the democratic space is being, is being manipulated. It's not free. The political, political campaign is not free. There are forces who want to, they don't want to remain status quo. We do not want to move forward. And that's why you are in a sorry state. So I am not speaking the mind of any political party. Mm. I am speaking the mind of civil society. Mm. What the civil society wants is, is a candidate with vision, a candidate with mission, a celebrate guy that will, take, that will take those states to the next level. And, and, and that's why I agree with him that when he said we should not go back. But we should move forward. Uh -huh. So me, I'm not, I'm not looking at Aswai Godalo. I'm not looking at uh, what is the other guy. Okay, Wolo. Okay, Wolo, whatever. But I, we are looking at them. If you want, want to give me my scorecard, I will give you my scorecard. Uh -huh. What is your scorecard? My scorecard on here yeah. is that I have a sentiment for a character that I've seen that I think will take the, the door to the next level. Aswai Godalo. Mm. That's my honest submission. Mm. Because you cannot, you cannot be a governorship candidate you cannot, you cannot postulate. Yeah, but, but let, this no, is where... It's yeah, my, in, it's no, no, it's my no, personal yeah, opinion. Personal opinion I, but, but, I am but, a serial writer. I'm a serial yeah, but, 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 but this is where, this is where, because you just said it now. But again, let, let us not mince issues here. I mean, uh, for the civil society, they don't belong to any political party, irrespective of the fact that voters. you as an individual. They, they are voters. voters. Yeah. They are but voters. The they are voters. voters. But again, because a lot of members of the civil society, they have this opinion too. You know, I mean, can't we have a situation whereby uh, the civil society may see all these uh, candidates, uh, you know, as okay, all of them, they have... Uh, the the, uh, the the property that every one of them have. I mean, you have the property, the other one has the property and all that. Let me give so you a scenario. It, it is not in one, in one, in one candidate. I'm not looking at that, that situation. Let me quickly give you a scenario. In United States, because the bastion of democracy, mm. some characters who were supporting a Donald Trump mm. in the Republican Party, they become tongue coat. They renege their allegation to Donald Trump. They said, this guy, we don't see a pathway in American politics. They are leaving Donald Trump. They are cut kind members. In the democratic system, you must you have your sentiment. You must have, you must have your political Free limits. Me, I believe in, I believe in uh, excellence. Yeah. I believe because I, I, I run a center, Nigeria Good Governor Research Center. We believe in excellence. We believe in the, the, the process where democratic dividends will be taken to the, to, to, to the poorest of the poor. But we don't have that because we have a situation whereby the most unprepared human beings have come to, you know, to government houses and they fail the people. Today, I speak the minority civil society that we want characters that are celebrated, mm. characters that can say their, say their ideas, their manifestos, mm. with whole rhetoric. Mm. One of the things, that's why I, I fall in love with the American political system. What not cut Joe Biden the other day? It was the first presidential debate, debate. between Donald Trump and uh, Joe Biden. 
And, 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 and the Democrats, they say, hey, gentlemen, you can't, you can't this man cannot win us election. Yeah, no, we talk, See, because this is not the first time that we're having that as an issue in our political space in the state. I, I remember about, about but, eight years ago, <laughs> we also had that, that same issue. I mean, the outgoing governor now, he was also, you know, there were allegations that let this man talk. I mean, we're not forgetting it. Uh, Harrison, we can't no, forget it. You see, you see, you see, the, 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 the election that brought in Gordon Obaseki, it was everywhere. Mm. It was on the um, uh, China's um, uh, debates. It was also on the um, ITV debates. That he was not allowed to speak. Who said uh, he, he spoke? He spoke. We were part of the He eventually Who? spoke, yes. but at, at, at the earlier stage, the red statement that he, he was not no, the one speaking. No, no, that Adam 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 Somole, no. That Adam Sushomole was not allowed uh, uh, to speak. Let me help him. Just let him be asked. What I'm saying is this. Godwin Enora Sobaseki when he came aboard, you know, Oshomole, that was the first tenor. Mm. Oshomole, in his nature, he will always want to dominate the campaign. Yeah, what, let us the be same careful with that now. No, you, that is his kind of person. Your, from your own no, perspective, that is his kind of person. the way you if see you him. If you give him a mic now, yeah. he will take over the place. The, way you, the way you see him. keep talking, you yeah, know? Yeah. So, people were now saying, give this mask. You're not the one running for governor. Mm. Mm. Do this space. And indoor, they started pushing it, then the man came aboard and he passed his message to the people. Yeah. Fair and good. Today, mm. you will be able, I'm, I'm happy that I'm one of those who supported Gordon Obaseki from the beginning to this moment. Mm. And I will continue to support him because he has been able to right the wrong. Mm. He might not be friend to so many persons mm. because he has refused to release the dumb money to some persons. Even within our political people are complaining. Mm -hmm. But those of us who believe in democracy, who believe in who believe in progress, who is going to government to put money in your pocket, we support the man. Yeah. As I was coming just I asked somebody, I said, will anybody come into a ministry of education? Iyao, I come and cast their vote for another party. Mm -hmm. Just enter that place and see what is happening there. Mm -hmm. Go to Agri up in Airport Road, ADP. Go and see what is happening there. Go to Vito Rifle Hub. This man has been able to touch everywhere. I went to a school of earth. I was amazed what I saw. Mm. So we want our candidates mm. who have presented his manifesto to adult people to stop to start from where Obaseki was stopped by November 12th. Okay. And we have assessed every other candidate that have presented themselves for this election, mm. the three major political parties. Mm. The Labour Party guy is qualified, but at this moment, in terms of cat and the competence and character, that's when we don't use our head. That's when we don't have led from, several, uh, several companies. Uh, yeah. He resigned from several multinational companies December 31st. Yeah, the same way other, 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 the 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 other candidates, they've also now, done. We they, know they, they, they have their We know they let yeah, yeah, they work before. Yeah, yeah. Has any of them been able to tell you where they have worked before? Anyway, I'm, let, let's know what I know. I, I, I'm saying my own, I'm selling my own candidate. Uh, yeah. And everybody is seeing what we are saying. Mm. He was the chairman of Stanley Bank, mm. Nigerian Beauties. We know where this man is coming no, which from. I, which I we know what he has done in the past. Yeah, no. Because of that, we believe in him. Beautiful. Now, 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 no, 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 which I, but I go, before we come off these political issues now, uh, you, you said a while ago that you always speak the minds of the, uh, the civil society. Now, what do you think is the perception of um, uh, these candidates, <laughs> you know, from the civil society point of view? What is their perception? I think uh, always the civil society will always side with the side of. Uh, progress, those things or characters or those uh, perspectives or uh, opinions that will better their lot. Uh, you were talking about Basaki just now, but our Basaki is, is, is not a first class governor. It's my opinion. Mm. It's not a first class governor. Why? Uh, because there are, there, are, there are some areas that are not done well. Mm. That's the part of the matter. But I'm not... If, 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 for instance, Obasaki that is being presented, no winter Gotako will not vote for him. Mm. That's my opinion. Because I'm my grass against him. Some of he has done so far, he has carried people away. You know, secondary schools, education, there are a lot of things that is not going for him. Yeah, there you go again. That was what a while ago. I was trying to tell you that, look, let us know where we are. I, I have not said, God if Obasaki is the coming, yeah. for instance, yeah. on the ballot, I will not vote for now, him. What is the but difference? Now, what I, is the difference between Obasaki coming and Obasaki supporting Aswe Gudalu now? Well, uh, looking at the three candidates, mm. my brother, you put 
you put the monkeys in, 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 into a cage, uh, and, you, and you give them food to eat. You, 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 know, you watch them. You see how they behave. You see the one that is most friendly to you. <laughs> After to the monkeys. I'm not saying all the people are monkeys, yeah. but I'm not giving an, uh, you know, an analogy. Look at the, the three dominant candidates. My honest submission. I think I go, I have a soft spot for Aswai Godalo. Mm. From looking at this pedigree. Well, I, 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 going by your analogy, have you tried to also see whether all the monkeys, read, I, I, it, I, I, the other monkeys that I run the center. Be <laughs> to? Nigeria Good Governance Research Center. I, I, I'm a serial author. I'm current. No. I, I, I'm, 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 I'm called a journalist. Yeah. I'm Nigeria Buru Chief, mm. AllTempo.com, probably United States. Mm. So I'm current. I'm on top of the issues. Mm. I've, I've, I've done my own work. Uh, for instance, I am not campaigning for Aswai Godalo, for instance. I'm not trying to speak the minds of generality of people. For instance... You, you cannot speak the minds of the generality of people. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to speak the minds of the civil society. Because, because civil, society, civil society will always go for the best. That is it. Because for me, I have looked at the Open Bolo guy. Hmm. The guy in PDP. No, I will let you say that because I, I know that the civil, the civil society has not chosen as well. We are not choosing. The, the, the civil society choose. has not chosen a candidate. But I know that. From my own perspective, yeah, yeah. I am a... I, I am not a, a motor park comrade. Mm. I went to the mail. Mm. So when I'm talking, I think I talk the minds of certain category of civil society. All right, society. so your perception, the civil society perception about the candidates. The civil society perception is that we've not seen the best coming from uh, the, the APC guy. Uh, Pueblo, about the candidates? The candidate, is, for example, the, the candidate is dodging to talk to, to the adult people. You, you cannot say so. The man, as the civil society approached him and he, and he does, just hold on, just hold on. See, like the, yeah. I just told you, yeah. Yeah. one, mm. I'm not a motor park comrade. I know. I hate it. Yeah. I can mention Yeah, when you say he's dodging, you must have facts. Well, there are facts. The, the, uh, the other day, I write television, he's calling it to come and talk. The are now playing politics, we come and appear on here. Yeah. Do you work in a rise television? It was on air. <laughs> we saw what happened. Mm. What happened in those states? Mm. I, I don't think I've seen him talk, you know, you know, talk to the people of Edo State. Yeah, but, but, and, and the few clips I've seen, yeah. honestly, yeah. it does not show that the guy is intelligent. Uh, that, you, 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 know, you cannot say so. Because it's I, not I, I, I remember, I remember there, there was a program that ITV, uh, Independent Radio and Television, did. He wasn't there, but his representative was there. Why was he not there? Why, why, what is, why was the PDP man not there? Why was Aswa okay. Gudalo not there? I think I will answer that. The why was The reason why the PDP yeah. kind of... PDP did not participate. Mm. It is because I don't want to do a, deb a debate in prison. Mm. It is the candidate that wants to govern us. You cannot go up and bring people to come and speak on their behalf. We cannot be party to that. I mean, the day you tell us you are doing a debate, our candidate will come here. But, Let them bring their candidate. But why, the, the, the candidate should be the one to talk the, to us. The, 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 the APC guy. So that the is AP, why the, the, the PDP said they will not attend. So that was what they did. No, that is, is, is you, see, you see, I've done my own, my own because I said I run a research center. Mm -hmm. I am an intellectual. Somebody cannot be speaking for him. I'm an intellectual. I'm not a cut and nail human being. Yeah. I'm an expert <laughs> in my field. So having done my research, looking at the three candidates, if they blindfold me, my opinion, mm. if I must vote and I will vote, I think I will go for the best guy. Because we, we want somebody that's articulate. Somebody that, 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 that is an epitome of excellence. Somebody that can be to deliver democratic dividends. We know some, some, some people, they become something when they come to power. We cannot run away from that. Yeah, no, what's I, but, what's I call oral, oral, being, being oral, being articulate orally. <laughs> it, it, it's not way of measuring intelligence. What I'm saying is that, yeah. based on what we've seen mm. at local international politics, mm. there are leaders who will tell you they are Jesus Christ, who they are Messiah, but when they come to power, they do something else. Anyway, I, let's... I, I am not, I, I'm trying... To be to, to, to be uh, celebrate. Yeah. To tell you that I'm not unaware, I'm not in the know about what people could do mm. when they get to power. Mm. But what we see now is what you react to. I, I'm reacting to it. Okay. That at least the way the three candidates, I think one of them has an edge. All right. All right. So, uh, gentlemen, uh, as we wrap up uh, this segment now, so that we can attend to the uh, second topic uh, that uh, we're handling, talking about the federal government setting up an interministerial committee uh, to enforce the Supreme Court's uh, ruling on uh, local government uh, autonomy. That's what we're going to be looking at. Uh, so, uh, just uh, one minute uh, each. Edo 2024, one more time. <coughs> well, I want to appeal to Edo people. 
that we should look at the various candidates. Let us look at their competence, their character, their capacity, where they are coming from. Then make our choice so that a door will move forward. We cannot imagine, even though we live in precarious political environment, it doesn't mean we should lower standard. We cannot lower standard in a door. For that simple reason, you will be the one to decide. Vote for the best. No matter the amount of money they are going to bring, the threat, the police we will go out on that day, we will cast our vote, we will defend our vote, we are not going to fight. We are appealing to you, vote for the PDP candidate. It's the best in as possible. Well, Sorry. you are campaigning. I won't let you do that. No, which I would All right, that is. Uh, for me, I want to enjoy the official society, mm. the adolites, to go for the best candidate. Okay. And uh, because uh, going for something less will never go well. Mm. Because given the reality on the ground, the, there are social economic issues. People cannot flow easily in the, in the economic realm. So the adult people should not allow themselves, mostly parents, should not allow their children to use their canal folders. They should not allow, allow themselves to be bought by a bag of rice, by a gulf of gari or something. They should ensure their vote counts. They should look for the right candidate and vote for. And should not allow people to, to be cloud their vision mm -hmm. so that they can vote the right candidate. Okay. The right candidate should be voted for. That, 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 that's what we have maintained here. Because the civil society will not go for the wrong candidate. We always know the candidate can deliver, at least from what we can see. All right, so uh, let's come up with that now. Uh, let's